Hello, it is I, Dr. Brian Dorgon 111, and welcome back to Bug Fables. Since the last episode, I stayed at the inn, and then wanted to come over to the chef guy here, because I was looking at my inventory, and I have a danger spud that somebody dropped. And so I thought I was going to try combining it with a honey drop and just see what it gets combined into, if anything. So let's try it out together. It did not work. Bad quality ingredients. You got a mistake. It recovers one TD, but don't eat it. Don't say you weren't warned. Okay, so that did not work out. Um, but now we know. And I guess the logbook got updated with a mistake. Um, let's just cook with one ingredient, because I also just have a honey drop that I'm going to convert into a glazed honey, which changes it from 5 TP to 8 TP, I believe. So it's kind of like always worth cooking one, but I was going to try combining it with other things and it didn't work out. Okay. So, to start things off for today, we need to head out to the Lost Sands, which are out to the east. You know what? I don't know that I'm going to eat the mistake, so why don't I go ahead and store it? I can still store 33 items, apparently. I think there's a 35 item capacity um, with the ant storage guy. Um, so yeah, apparently if you put ingredients that don't work well together, uh, you get a mistake. So the Lost Sands are out here to the east. Um, but I think out farther to the east, southeast, and then to the north. Yeah. So this is the guy who tells us that the piers and the lost sands are out here. And I believe I have Bug Me Not currently equipped, which means I don't have to worry about, yeah, random seedlings causing me encounter problems. And, yeah, we're kind of, oh, he dropped another danger spot. I'll try cooking it without combining it with anything next time I have a chance, and we'll see what happens there. Um, this is kind of one of the first parts where it feels like, oh, Jen and Ari, I think are these guys' names? It's going to say where the game feels like it's kind of opening up in terms of you can kind of explore a bunch of different directions. Ah, geez. How does this bridge work? Where's the worker? I hope we cross soon. These underlings don't play nice at all. Alright, so that's the... Oh, he dropped a berry. Nice. Alright, so BV has the Beamerang. And so we can actually activate the bridge. And so it seems other explorer teams were blocked. Whoa, thanks. We were stuck here for a while. Wasn't much. We'll get going now. See you in Defiant Root. Right, that's our ultimate goal through the Lost Sands. All right, and that was still finishing up its animation, I suppose. So here's the bridge. Here's a Venus bud. It's you two, or three, again. Venus. I decided to help you in your quest. You're going to beat stuff up with us? I'm not a combat goddess, but I can heal you up in no time. For a small offering of eight berries. Why would a goddess need money? Arya and my followers want to thrive in life too, and they're way too dedicated to me to get other jobs. So it's the least I can do for them. Eight berries is nothing. Okay, so if we want to heal on the go, we can find these buds and give them eight berries. And when it says heal, I wonder if that's only healing. What is this thing? and not getting my TP back. The Lost Sands. It's been a while. They're way too huge. It's gonna take ages. It'd be nice if we could just move a bit faster. Well, why not just run? If we tap X twice with me at the front, I'll give it my all. Whatever gets us out of there faster. Okay, so I just learned a new thing. Kabu can dash. Double tap X. Press C or X to cancel it. Okay. 
he can use the dash through skill in battle. Neat, so we got a new skill. Um, let's go ahead and save that progress. Alright, and let's put Kabu in front and just try it out. I see. Do I just go in a straight direction? No, I can steer a little bit. Um, but it's a little bit awkward. Okay. Queen's allowed you to go through. Go on in. Do be careful. The number of bandits roaming the sands has been increasing. Keep going northwest to the base of the big tree. Don't go northeast. Okay. And who is this person? Or bug. <laughs> who is this bug? I'm still preparing. It's much bigger than it seems. Everywhere you look, there's sand. Keep a mental map. Okay, so I want to go northwest, which is up and left. And we've added it to my logbook. And there's like a fork broken off, stuck in here or something. All right, new enemies. Let's get V in front for this so that we can stun and have an extra bonus action, which I guess I'll use to spy since we have a new enemy. Psycorp. Poison. Okay, they have defense. Leaf, get out, get it out if it goes under. I see, so they can burrow underground as well, it sounds like. Okay. Um, with one defense, uh, V could still hit it from the front for, I think, three? Only two. Okay. Um, Kabu got a new skill. Dash through. Charges forward, damaging all grounded enemies. This also flips enemies. Let's try it out. Keep pressing C to fill up the bar. Okay. It is very hard to mash well enough to get that done. Uh, but that was good. That dealt some damage. Um, you can probably finish off the front guy with just a basic attack. I was wrong. And now they've gone underneath. Okay, so that means Leaf needs to do his thing. Um, I guess I'll just kill the front one. And then the back one's probably going to pop up and attack. Is there anything I want to do in the meantime? I think nothing. Like, we've already spied. I can't really attack. So let's do nothing. Okay. Didn't know how to time the blocking there. Did not work out. Alright, but we got this going. And we finished him off. Oh, 12 XP. That's not bad. Alright, so I want to head basically northwest, but I see that there's kind of two things that are going northwest-ish and then one going to the east. Um... Let me try to take the westmost path and then circle around to the north and we'll see how that goes and that'll also be easier for me to keep track of mentally in my head. Hopefully, maybe. There's some kind of mushroom over there. Oh, what are you? You're like a cactus. So there's the underling seedling that we already know about, but then there's the cactus guy, so let's spy him. Underling and Cactling is his name. Or his identifier description. I don't get science. Alright, that's a defense of two. Yikes. Too tough for the Beamerang. Better let Kabu handle it. Okay. Uh, okay. Um, let's just take out the first guy first and we'll get a sense of how the Cactling or whatever it is is going to attack. That guy went underneath, so we need Leaf to bring it back up. And then Kabu won't be able to finish it off, but we'll get close. 
Alright, so he hit underneath. I blocked too early and I got poisoned. Yuck. And that guy, okay, shoots spikes. Okay. Alright. Well, now I know. Ah, uh, he's gone underneath again, so leaf, do your thing. Alright, so that's one down. And then Kabu can apparently deal some damage to this guy. Can he flip it? Oh, I didn't press the button at the right time, apparently. I bought the spike this time, but I didn't block the second one. Okay, um... The... why don't you secret stash Kabu? Since he is hurting. Oh, that seemed to have also gotten rid of the poison. I don't think I remember that that was a thing. Um, Kabu, let's see if he can actually flip it this time. He did. And that got rid of its defense. Okay, so that means the others can actually deal some real damage now. So that is good. Great. Alright, I blocked poorly. And he does a couple of attacks. And now V is hurting. Um, but let's have Kabu flip it again. And then V and Leaf can finish it off. It's fine. Alright. Great. Alrighty. So let's see. How badly is V hurting? V needs seven. I do have... Uh, I guess it's Roasted Berries and the Leaf Omelette, but the Leaf Omelette is, uh, nine, right? So... Yeah, let's just not leave V in the front, I suppose. So if we do get surprise attacked, we'll be ready. Um, but I would like to surprise the enemy, so let's try to... Stun with the Boomerang. Oh, it's gonna come under- oh boy. It's gonna try to come underground, okay. Yeah, this guy's hard to stun. Okay, let's just get Kabu in the front then and just take the attack. Alright, this time we got Psycor in the back. Um, I'm not close enough to leveling up that I feel like, quote-unquote, wasting my teamwork points in this battle. So we'll just kind of wait patiently to fight through it. We'll tank a little bit of damage along the way. Uh, and then just hope that everything turns out okay. That's the current plan. If we need to go into our um, bag of resources for healing, uh, we could do so, and it looks like we're going to need to. <laughs> um, okay, let's see. So Kabu is now hurting as well. Um... Do I want to use my dash through? How much? Remind me, it's 5 TP. That's a lot of TP to hit both of these guys. I could use Ice Fall and uh, hit both for less. So yeah, let's do that, actually. Let's use Ice Fall. Okay, and they both got frozen. So now Kabu could take a moment to use an item, or he could use Pep Talk to bring V back to life, but V will just come up on the next battle. Um, so I think instead I'll have Kabu use the Leaf Omelette on himself. And then he'll be almost healed back up. Yeah, that seems reasonable. Um... I don't think it really matters in terms of how I deal damage at this point. So we'll have you deal some there. We'll have you deal- oh, I should have had Kabu deal that guy, I guess. Alright. So, learning a new enemy set. Uh, still learning about how to dodge their attacks. And so... That makes things a little bit interesting. Oh, I super blocked. Good for me. Alright. Um, yeah, let's finish him off. And then let's see where we are in terms of experience and level ups, and if I need to use some more items or what's going on. Yeah, still have ways to go. 
I could, since I have all these berries, I could go visit that Venus bud and pay the eight berries in order to uh, get some healing. And then we'd also find out if it uh, repairs my TP or not. So I'm kind of tempted to do that. Um, okay, this did circle around, and that was a one-way passage that I just went back down. So I think the Venus bud is... Was it right here? Yes, so let's find this out. So I'm low on hit points with a few people, and I've got 10 of 22 whatevers. Teamwork points. So, heal us. My hit points are- oh! And it gave me my TP back too. Okay. So it is basically an in in the field. Okay, that's actually very good. Okay, and that means- yeah, that's not too far away, and so... I can use my teamwork points if needed. Um, this guy is back. I don't necessarily need to fight him. I didn't go this way before. And is this the same screen I was just on? Yes, it is. So I see how all these things connect. So I've already been on this screen. So this is the screen where I just dodged guys and ran back to the south. Um, this time... What type of guy is this? Oh! It's somebody new. Yikes. Alright, I did block that at least. Uh, I won't be able to spy the new guy until he gets up from underneath the sand, so let's see if this will do that. Arrow Worm. There he is. Um... Let's have V spy him. He doesn't have defense. It's buried all the time. I can't be super sure. Leaf, get it out of the ground, or we're gonna have to book it out of here. Okay. So basically, another burrowing enemy. I guess since it's sandy, we're gonna see lots of those. And hard to judge when to dodge that attack. Alright, but I did some dodging there, but now people are hurting. Um, I could use one of my uh, other berry things. <sighs> Let's get one of these guys off the battlefield first thing. Um, Kabu, I think, will be able to finish this guy off. There we go. And then let's use... Yeah, I have a bunch of these roasted berries, and it's kind of rare that everybody's down in hit points, so... Let's use that just to give everybody a little bit of healing during battle. Alright, I did not block that very well. But if I flip you, you're gonna lose your defense, and then the others can deal some real damage. There's three points of damage from you. And two from you. Great. Alright, I blocked too early again. And Kabu can just finish him off. Okay, Leaf is really hurting this time around. And we saw that enemies respawned after I uh, visited the Venus Healing Bud. So, I think I should not turn back, but how am I going to go forward? Because... Okay, it seems like at some point I might be able to break that. I presume I can't get around here. Yeah, that just brings me to the start of the screen. So I was trying to go northwest, and I didn't see a way to go to the northwest. Unless I missed something over here. There's an enemy back there, but it doesn't seem like I can get through there. Uh, is that a different guy than I saw before? Oh, it's just a underling seedling or whatever. Oh dear. Well, he surprised me. Oh boy. Good block. Okay. Um, Kabu should really be in front because he's our tank. Okay, we've seen this battle before. I'm going to deal with these guys and then figure out where to go next. 
Okay, I dealt with those enemies, and I'm only somewhat worse for wear. But I did not see a way to go in the direction that I'm supposed to go. Is it possible that I can jump across here somewhere? I don't think so. I mean, let's try it. That does not work. Is there a mechanism somewhere across the way that I failed to see to activate? Like, I don't see anything up here. And we can see that there's like a way over here, but I don't know how to get through there. And back on this screen, there were these rocks I couldn't break. And there was that thing that I couldn't go through. Alright, so we're supposed to go northwest, but I don't see a way to go to the northwest. I do see a way to go east. <laughs> so I guess we're going to check it out. Uh, and then maybe we can circle back around. Oh, hello! I believe that's an HP plus medal. Can I figure out a way to get up there? That's a good question. Let's go ahead and do one of these. Uh, v has an extra turn, but Kabu first needs to... I think this is worth doing a dash through, actually. So let's go ahead and spend a bunch of TP. Oh boy, it is hard to hit the button well enough to do that. Okay, but it does also flip guys who get flipped, so that is good. And yeah, let's just go all out because I think I'm about to level up, and so let's do an ice fall to hit uh, all these guys at once. Very nice. And then um, you could just attack the front guy and kill him off, so let's just do that. And the other guy's frozen. Oh, and V has another attack. Okay, uh, let's see if you can kill this guy. Not quite. Alright, that's fine. Get ready. Oh, I don't have to get ready. I thought he was going to attack, but he just went underground. So we have somebody who is good at dealing with that. And I believe this is going to be a rank up. Yes. Nice. Uh, what do I want more of? I do have a lot of medals, and I'm just about to find another one. So I'm kind of tempted to go for metal points this time, because it's plus three. That sounds pretty good. Let's try metal points. Your pouch can now carry three more items for a total of 13. Oh, that's good. I had been running low on inventory space more than once. Um, so that is a nice upgrade. Hooray for that. Can I beamerang this? Oops. If I do this, uh, that went not the way I wanted to go. There's only a tiny little ledge here. No, it's still in the wrong spots. There must be another way up, maybe? Can I hit it from here? Can I jump over here? I might have been able to jump onto that little yellow rock from here. If I can gauge depth. Uh, I'm going to try that a few times and see if I can get to somewhere where I can get that metal. Oh, I got it the next try. Hey, nice. HP plus. Okay. Um, speaking of medals, I have more metal points. Um, I have three points that are currently not in use. I think I'm going to put on HP plus on other party members. So everybody has some more hit points. We'll try that out. Um, they're not all healed up right now because it added to my hit point capacity uh, without actually adding to my hit points. But that's okay. Uh, what do we have here? Big lock. I do not have anything that would fit in there. Okay, so there's a locked door in the sands to the east, and there's still a way to go to the north. So let's check it out. Uh, is that a friendly dude, or is that a bandit? Because I've heard that there are bandits here. Uh, you seem friendly. My research points to a relic being in the area, but I've hit a dead end. Could there be a path I haven't noticed yet? Yeah, I've been wondering about that too. Um, is this more sand pit that we just fall into? It looks like it is. Oh, I was able to jump across here. Okay. Maybe I can go this way. And then I can go back to the west, and that's what I wanted to do. I just want to get a sense of the area before I do so. Alright, so there is north and there's west. I'm trying to go northwest, so let's try going this way. 
And we find ourselves... Somewhere where we can't get anywhere. Maybe we're gonna run into that dead end. Despite... Ourselves. I don't need to fight every enemy right now, because I'm kind of traveling a long ways away. There's a soda pop can. Oh, there's a save. I will save my progress. We did just rank up. And there's a way to go further to the west, which is kind of what I want to do. Um, but I'm not sure that this is actually going to get me anywhere. Yeah, okay, this is a complicated place. I understand what they said in terms of, like, getting lost. And there aren't, like, names of each screen that you're on. So I'm just trying to keep, like, a mental map in my head, but I'm not sure how well that's going to work. Um... This is an explorer duo that Kabu knew about. The Lazy Pair, right? The Slackers or something? It's Team Not Slacker. Oh hey, nice going at the festival. Good moves. You really did come all the way out here. Do you remember our talk? We think this here is the fabled sand castle. What, this brick? Well, yes. This tablet's just waiting for its secret to be unearthed. You think it's just gonna come out of the sand? Maybe. No clue what's inside. But what's a good castle that has no treasure? So how does it come out? Sorry, we don't know it yet. And when we do, we've got to tell the queen. Ah, It's still good to see a familiar face in the desert. Well now, take care on your mission. I'm sure we'll meet when we figured this out. Stay safe. There's a hole. Alright. So... This is kind of in the northwest, kind of like where we're trying to get to, but we don't have whatever goes there. It's the sand castle. Um, I am trying not to lose my bearings, but it's getting difficult. So there's the save that we just hit up. Oops. Here's a battle that I didn't intend to take, but now we're here. Um, this looks like a good opportunity for Kabu to dash through again. So let's use this awesome skill. Right. Mash, 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 mash! Alright. Very good. Um... We can probably take out one of these guys. Yeah. And so that'll be good enough for me, and then with only one to have to defend, like, that's fine. And I blocked. Great. Oop, crap. I... I did it bad. So I should have... V... Turn Relay back to Kabu, so that he can try again. And even though his attack will be weaker, he'll still be able to at least flip it. And that'll give Leaf the opportunity to deal some damage, because now he doesn't have defense. Oops. Alright, I did not block properly there. Alright, so I took extra damage that I didn't need to take. Um, but we're still doing okay. And we're still getting more XP. So that's not bad. Um, but what is bad is that we don't know where to go. Because this is where I saw the thing across the way, but I had no way to jump across. And it's not like there's any... Oh, wait. Hold on. There's an exclamation point there. So, okay. So I can knock down these... Th okay, so I should have done that in the other spot as well, it appears. So I need Kabu in the lead. To be able to knock these things down. Alright. Uh, was the save thingy right here? Yes. So I'm also going to hit the save thingy. Now that I've figured things out. So I believe it was here. Yeah, so if I hit this... Well, it's kind of a good news, bad news thing, right? Because it just it gave me a shortcut. But it still doesn't help me get to anywhere further to the west. It looks like I'd have to be over there to knock down another one. And we didn't see a way to be over there. And so I feel like I exhausted all of the possibilities in that direction. Back on the screen where there was this guy who said he was lost and found a dead end, the researcher. Yeah, over here. I don't think I explored all of this screen yet. 
because I didn't walk over to this side. Well, now I think I have. Hmm, do you have anything new to say? Um, it also almost looks like there's stairs, like, right up here. But I'm not sure how to do that. I presume this just causes me to fall. Oh! I could just walk across this. I thought this was going to be a hole that I would fall in. Alright. Um, cactus coming to life. Does this do anything? Is there anything hidden back here? Ooh, there might be. Uh, there's not, but there might have been. And remind me why I couldn't go this way. I don't know that I ever came this way before. Oh, I'm on the other side of this. Ho, hey, hey, hey. Ho, ho, ho. Hey, hey, ho, ho, let's go. So I have never been here. And this seems like progress. Okay. So we're... Oops. Uh, can I? Yes. I will attack you, but I just want to make sure that I have the first attack. Okay. And we got another side core. Um, let's just focus on the side core for now. And V can deal a fair amount of damage to this guy. Uh, v would only deal one more. So what I should do is I should move Kabu to the front. And have him attack, and then have Leaf attack, and then V... Can she deal one damage through one defense? I don't think so, but if she did a turn relay to Kabu, I'm pretty sure even a weakened Kabu can finish this guy off. Yeah, there we go. And I still, I can't learn to know the telegraph of that guy's attacks to know which attack he's going to do. So I keep blocking at the wrong time. Okay, but I think we should be able to finish this guy off without too much trouble. This won't quite do it. I did it again. The exact same thing that just happened last time. And that knocked Kabu out. Oh my gosh, I had no idea. He was so low. Alright, we'll finish him off. And how far was I from Venus healing? Pretty far, actually. Um, what are the chances I'm about to get somewhere great? Let's take a risk. Oops. Somewhere great is not down there, by the way. Um, but I'm not sure that it's over here either, because we can't go that way. So... Oh, can I jump across here? However, there's about to be another enemy. So I'm gonna want V in front, both because V has the hit points and to do the stunning. And do I want to use a healing item? Yeah... Oh, except for I don't have... I already used my Leaf Omelette at some point, didn't I? I have mostly TP items. Okay, so in that case I should have V secret stashing more often. Okay. Right, I am built for TP. So, we're gonna have... We're gonna have V do an attack to start. But then, rather than deal one damage, we'll have V use Secret Stash to heal Kabu some. And then we'll have Kabu... Yeah, just attack. Alright, I like how much thinking goes into pretty much every battle in this game. There's very little that becomes trivial. I did not dodge that, sadly. And now both guys are underground. So Leaf needs to... I'm gonna need to uh, trade... Trade, uh, do a turn relay in order to get these guys. Uh, maybe not. 
Kabu could take that guy out. V needs to secret stash again, I think. Because Kabu is still very hurting. And then Kabu can take this guy out. Alright. And I still didn't manage to dodge, so Kabu is hurting again. Um, it's deja vu all over again. Alright, so let's get this guy up. And then... I still am going to Secret Stash again. Because I can always regain my TP out of battle by consuming a Honey Drop. And so, you can just attack. Here we go. Any burrows. And I blocked that time. Hooray. Good job, me. So V's going to secret stash yet again. And Kabu is actually going to turn a profit. <laughs> and be up to six hit points now. Amazing. Uh, but we need Leaf to get this guy back above ground. And then Kabu can attack him. And... I blocked too late. Darn. Still hard to time. Um, let's have the secret stash again. I found a pattern. <laughs> it's working for me. Okay. Now, because I can only do that in battle. And so now I can have you attack. And we win battle. Hooray! Okay, so I used a ton of TP doing healing there. Oh, one of the berries just bounced off into the abyss, and now I'm sad. Oh, there's more berries over there, too. Hopefully that guy can't figure out how to cross. Um, so now I want to go into my items and use one of my many glazed honeys. And use another one of my glazed honeys. And now we have 18 TP once again. And so I'm feeling a little bit better about my chances. And Kabu actually has some hit points. And V can try to stun this guy. This is a new enemy now. So that's always scary. But let's get an extra attack at the beginning. And we'll be able to spy him. Yeah, I'm just going to spy him right from the outset. Alright, that's a thief. A thief? There's nothing worse in the world. The nerve to steal my hard-earned treasure. Doesn't look too tough. Knock him out of the air and then take everything he's stolen. Alright, sounds like plan B. Um, do I want to use TP? Not necessarily. Although if Kabu did a dash through... Yeah, let's see if I can end the bat battle quickly. Alright, so if I dash through... There we go. Yes. Deal a bunch of damage. And then if I do an Ice Fall... No, I didn't manage to freeze either of them. That's a shame. Oh, crap. Okay. I managed to block. And that guy went underground. Okay, that actually wasn't too bad. Because now I believe I can take you out. Alright, and you're underground, so you need to freeze to get him back above ground. And then Kabu can attack and finish him off. Nice. Okay, use some TP, but that's what it's there for. Um, I may need more TP in the not-too-distant future. Oh, the berries fell off. Uh, but there's another berry over here. So let's go ahead and use... Oh, it's my final glazed honey. Do I want to use it? Let's not use it just yet. Because maybe there's about to be another save point. Oh, there's... Maybe the berry that falls off of the world, like, respawns back on the world or something? Is maybe what's happening there? I'm not sure. Is there a save point coming up? There is! And healing! Nice! Okay. Have I come for healing? Yes, heal us. Zing, zing, zoom, zizzle. All right, we're all healed up. 
That was definitely worth the money. I would like to save. That was definitely worth the save. And now where are we? Oh, we're in a cutscene. Oh, if it isn't those peppy explorers. Um, who is that? Hiya. Hey, Team Snake Mouth, how's it going? Well, it's a bit hot. You're traveling to Defiant Route as well? Yep, we're on a mission to protect these merchants. Interesting. Specifically, our deal snail. We could fight or run, but this one's pretty wimpy. Ah, I see, it's the traveling caravan merchant kind of people, okay. It's been a super good day though, easiest mission we've ever had. Oh, you jinxed it! Um, dang it, Ari. <laughs> Bandits! You've got some nerve trying to bug us. It's okay. We can make the money back. Don't get hurt for... I'd rather go fi down fighting than yield to these scoundrels. You speak brave words for a powerless merchant. This is your last chance to surrender to the Wasp Kingdom. Oh no, it's the Wasp that we weren't supposed to go near. Like we'd take... Like we'd let you take anything. We outnumber them? So I'm feeling good about our odds here. Let's show what we can do. Can't share a few things. Now we're gonna have to take it all. Oh no. Those three. They're the one from the report. That'll pay a pretty penny. Let's capture them. You'll keep your vile limbs away from my friends. Let's kick their butt. Let's go. Alright. So there's two new dudes. I don't get a first attack. I should probably spy, but I'm not going to. Uh, what I am going to do is put my tank in the front. Knock at least one of these other guys out of the air. I think maybe even both. So let's knock you out of the air. And then let's turn relay to let V uh, knock this guy out of the air. And then we're going to have Kabu dash through. That is my plan. Because this seems like a very good attack. 4-4-4. Four, four, four. Nice. 12 damage off of one attack. I blocked. I went too early. Oh, he stole! He grabbed my, um... He's a thief. <laughs> he grabbed my uh, healing item. That's not very nice. Um... Let's hit you. I got two guys on the ground. Let's do another dash through. Even though it's only going to hit two. And then I'm going to use an Ice Fall. Yeah, I feel good with that. Okay. So we killed the thief and presumably we'll get our item back. And then I'm going to try an Ice Fall. If I get right in the middle. I even froze one. That's good. And I did a block, but only one of the two. Okay. I'm feeling pretty good about how this battle is going. So I'm going to have you spy on the front guy so we can learn about him. He's a burglar. He has defense. Alright, but it doesn't seem like there's any interesting commentary about the enemy itself. Um, so yeah, let's just focus on the burglar for now. And V would be able to finish it off if she used a skill. Um, I can't remember if Tornado Toss will hit hard enough. So I'm going to use Hurricane Toss just to ensure that I kill this guy. That was probably overkill. But I wanted him down. Oh, he calls for help. 
Okay, I didn't see that coming, I will admit. Uh, but that's good because it gives me the opportunity to um, scout these guys. Or at least that's what I'll tell myself. So let's have Leaf Scout, Spy, whatever. It is a Wasp Scout. You won't be able to call for backup while frozen. Got it. So they're going to call for backup unless they're frozen, potentially, is maybe what I learned. All right. Um, I'm running low on TP here. Do I have any more glazed honey? I do. Do I want to eat it now? I think maybe yes. Yeah, let's eat some glazed honey. Alright, didn't do a good job blocking there. That time I did. Okay. So now I need them knocked out of the sky so Kabu can do his super attack, I think. So let's have the... Beamerang. And then let's have Leaf turn relay to V. So that V can Beamerang once again. And then Kabu, it's time for another dash through. Go, 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 go! Alright, block, block. Oh dear, he's got a different attack. Okay, I wasn't able to block that one. And Kabu's down. Can these guys finish them off? I think yes. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe not. I do have some TP. I do have a magic seed in my inventory. Let's make sure I take one of the enemies down. So if I tornado toss this guy... That will kill him for sure. And then I could use a magic seed out of my inventory to bring... Oh, I don't have a magic seed in my inventory. I'm a big fat liar. Crap. <laughs> uh, okay. In that case... Uh, you could fridge and cough it in this guy. That's good. Let's do that. Uh, why can't I? Because he's in the air. And he has to be on the ground. Okay. Uh, is there another item you could use that would help? Roasted berries would help me stay alive, potentially. Or I could throw the hard seed to knock him down and deal some damage. Both of these have potential. I'm gonna throw the hard seed. Clunk. Alright. Darn. Um... He only has five hit points left. I think I can kill him now if V knocks him out of the air. Yeah, just to make absolutely sure, I'm gonna use Frigid Coffin. Oh, except for then I have to press things in order. Okay, uh, XCZ, right. Did it, I killed him. Hooray! And we got a bunch of XP, and we're right by a spot where we can save and heal. Blast! We've got to go back and report this. I'm still getting paid, right? Shut it! Let's go! We won't forget this. Good job, Team Snake Mouth. That was terrifying. Thank you. Thanks, Team Snake Mouth. We're gonna be fine. There are weaklings. You're welcome. <laughs> Those wasps are showing up more, huh? It's worrying indeed. We should report this as soon as we're able. We're just humble merchants. We can't help too much. But we're very grateful for your help. This isn't much, but take it. A crystal berry! I still don't know what to do with them. I didn't even need to ask this time. Ovi. Of course, you won't find merchants in debt. With this, we're even. We can keep the merchants safe from here. We're almost at the town. Don't let us slow you down. You would never, but thank you. We'll keep going now. Safe travels! Okay, we did a thing. Now we will do another thing, which is to heal again. Which was right over here, right? Yes.
I presume I didn't get a full heal, but I didn't actually look. I did not. Okay. Just didn't want to waste my berries if I didn't need to sometimes after those encounters. You get healed for free for no apparent reason. This was not one of those times. Alright, so we are going to go ahead and save things there. And that is more great progress. Apparently we're most of the way toward the town. We defended some merchants and learned our way around the Lost Sands. I hope as always that you all are having a great day. And I will see you again soon with more Bug Fables. For now, bye bye.